This video is brought to you by ExpressVPN. If you looked up French President Macron's recent visit to the Democratic Republic of Congo, you'll believe me if I told you this footage of the French President I'm about to show you was really underreported by the world news. Only a handful of independent media and African YouTubers news channels had to let the world know that Africa was not to be messed with. But first, a word from our sponsor. You see, one of the biggest challenges we face in modern times is censorship. Have you ever tried accessing a web page, stream a video, or look for any kind of media for a research, entertainment, or educational purposes from the internet, but got a restriction alert because it was not available in your location, or because of censorship? Well, with ExpressVPN, you can securely have unlimited access to any content anywhere from the comfort of your seat. By just choosing one of the available 94 locations provided, ExpressVPN masks your device's unique IP address, making it difficult for big techs and government to monitor and collect your data for their own agendas, giving you unrestricted access to all parts of the internet at terrific speeds. To get ExpressVPN, just click the link below and when you use my link, you will get your first three months free. Frank Afrique no longer exists. On 4th March 2023, the French President Emmanuel Macron visited Kinshasa, DRC, where a tense moment was witnessed at a joint press conference. The Democratic Republic of Congo President Felix Tshisekedi wagged a finger at Macron, reminding him to respect Africans and not to act as if always in the know of what is necessary to Africans. Adding, we must establish a policy of equals. This is what happened and how things transpired. This is my spot. This spot. How we cooperate must change. The way Europe and France treat us, you must begin to respect us and see Africa in a different way. You have to stop treating us and talking to us in a paternalistic tone, as if you are always absolutely right and you are not. I want to answer that. When a French journalist makes a statement, that does not represent the French government. We must not mix things up. No. No, no, no. This is not an official position of France. I was referring to the statements of Mr. Le Drian. He is a French official. The words African reconciliation belongs to Le Drian, not a journalist. Yes, you are right. But Mr. President, we know where this rhetoric came from, and we know in what electoral context it was said. And there is no derogatory element in this formula of Ledrian. 